Good morning, guys. This is Steven here. Um, it's what time is it? It's 8 52. That means I'm 52 minutes late for work, but that's okay because it's my last day to work. Let's check it out. Great, I didn't get chewed by my boss today. So I can show you what I do. So right now I work as a temporary and my only job to do is to file these papers. These papers right here. I've been filing these papers for the past few weeks already and it got, it was much worse than what it was before. Let me show you. There's this much to file, one by one. And there's this much to file. About a thousand papers per box. Here's another box. And here's a whole cabinet full of papers to file. It used to be much worse. There was like five boxes that I had to file. And actually, the boxes are right over here. Yeah, the work I've done. It's very tedious and mundane, and I do it eight hours a day for 40 hours a week for the past few weeks. Let me show you what it looks like. Now you might be wondering, Steven, doesn't this make you a little bit crazy? I think so. But, I'm also wearing a jacket because this room can get cold sometimes and I sometimes get hungry so I try to scour for some food around and I did find some food and I managed to store some. Let me show you what it looks like. So I got some snacks to, to provide me enough food for the rest of the week or perhaps even a year. But today's my last day, so I might as well take them all with me without my boss knowing. So, yeah. Does this make me crazy? Nah. Hey guys, so right now I'm in the break room, and for some reason there's like a weird telephone right here for some reason in the break room. But anyways, I just want to do a little personal rant of how I've been feeling this month. This month, a lot of my friends are graduating, which I'm very proud for that. And shortly afterwards, I started to get this feeling, this feeling of how do I describe it, like a guilt, guilty feeling, that I'm not able to graduate with them on time at the same time. Um, it's just that feeling that's been bothering me this whole semester even, because all my friends are able to move on to grad school or get a job while I still remain in college. So again, that's something that I've been wanting just to be like, oh, can I just get a degree already and work just like all my friends. But again, I learn from my mistakes. I keep on pushing, persevering, and um, just wait till I get my degree and move on. That's that. It isn't a race. Life isn't a race. It's a marathon. As long as you finish it and get there, you get there. I gotta keep reminding myself. I don't want to be let down. Just gotta, I just gotta be proud for them, really. Um, so yeah, time to get back to work. And all right, I'm already out. It's time for me to get in my car and do something else today. So, uh, but the plan is that, the plan is that I'm gonna actually test drive a car. So I gotta go to a dealership today and test drive their car and get some money, really. So let's go there. So I just pulled up at the dealership, I brought my coupon which I actually printed on the back of my uh, old teeth x-ray. <laughs> yeah, pretty silly but they'll probably take it. I've been to this dealership before and um, they didn't let me test drive, they just let me, they just took the coupon and sent the check to my house and that was that. It, was, it took like I believe like a week to 10 days to get the ch check and I just hope it happens again so be right back. And it worked! They're gonna mail the check to my house in about 6 to 8 weeks, which is longer than I expected. So what can you do? Easy money though. So right now, I'm at Starbucks. I already ordered my drink already, so... I'm gonna wait for my friends tonight to do some karaoke. So in the meantime, I'm just gonna be on my laptop. Here, I'll just try to see. I'm just gonna be on my laptop, just chilling, just checking out what's my agenda and all that. 
And yeah, we'll see, we'll see my friends there. It looks like these guys are enjoying their food. <laughs>